Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and uh, one of the things that has been introduced with Windows 10 that over time has been improved, changed and you can do quite a lot of things with it is the famous Windows uh, game bar. For any gamers it could be useful for all sorts of reasons. It can give you frames per second of games. It can, You can actually do game recordings and capture and there's a lot of options. When you press the uh, Windows key and the letter G, this is where the game bar appears at the top. So you have a lot of information depending on the games that you play, the frame rates, you can have the controller bar um, depending on the game. So for example here if I switch mode, like you can see that Forza, Halo Infinite is two of the games that I have played recently. Uh, there's a lot of uh, achievements, it brings you to all of the different panels and the resources used by these games, performance and so on. Depending also on the type of computer you have, there are other features. For example, here I've got the uh, armory crate that can be opened. This is typical and, uh, and specific to Asus computers um, with the gaming laptops. Um, so depending on what type of gaming laptop or gaming computer you have, you'll see different options also appear. Uh, which is also nice. And of course you always have the performance tab on the bottom left. So this is going to tell you how much video RAM you're using, standard RAM, um, GPU and CPU resources and so on. And when you're gaming you have your frames per second so you can see the performance, compare performance between different machines. So there's a lot of uh, interesting changes in the game bar, a lot of options and you can also have the different gaming um, settings uh, and personalized. So uh, really still a nice uh, feature to have, I think, to have this uh, Windows game bar has, uh, it gives you all sorts of details when you are actually doing some gaming. Um, so my, I actually use it regularly. I will turn it on, check out different settings, different parameters, uh, my frame rates, stuff like that. Um, and also you can compare if you have a Windows 10 machine and a Windows 11 machine you can of course compare all the data information see if one is better than the other. In my opinion Windows 11 is as good as, was, as Windows 10 for gaming that, that is sure because I don't see any problems in my gaming sessions it works actually really well. So uh, Windows key and G or if you have of course an Xbox controller for your PC uh, you can just press the Xbox controller button to uh, have the uh, menu pop up at any time. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.